What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network. There's some very important stuff that you guys need to know. Nintendo recently published a little article, or rather not even an article, just a little paragraph, speaking about hacking, things like Pokegen, um, using your cell phone to upload Pokemon to your hard save file in your cart. Nintendo addressed a lot of these issues and they actually talked about it on your Japanese Pokemon website specifically saying they are saying that in X and Y any Pokemon that you may try to hack over and then bring over to the game are going to possibly delete your save game and not only that but if you do manage to get them into the game could help to corrupt the save state of anybody that you battle against in Pokemon X and Y as well. Now all of you already know that right now the 3DS is currently unhackable in terms of its 3DS function. You can play Nintendo DS ROMs on it using a flash card that is compatible, but you cannot tamper with the 3DS functionality itself. You could dump the ROMs, but there's no way to currently play them right now. So when you consider all this information that's known, right now Nintendo is going to really far lengths to be able to prevent hacking, to prevent things like Pokegen and Pokesop, ROMs, things like that. Their main reason why I think they're doing this is because at the end of the day here, we're so used to our hacking of the game and importing Pokemon and you know making perfect sets and such that we kind of forgot at some point that it is illegal stuff, you know? Like it is not stuff that we're supposed to be able to do. No one is supposed to be able to have a perfect IV Pokemon or have wonderful perfect Eevee. Well, Eevees you could do perfectly if you really are devoted to it. But um, in general, there shouldn't be as the game shouldn't be as fast as we're making it, and by hacking the game and such, we actually are accelerating the game so they go past their expiration date really, really quickly. As you can probably tell, Pokemon, in terms of 5th gen, at least to me, kind of feels like it got old really, really fast, simply because people are just hacking this game and, you know, importing their Pokemon and making perfect sets all over the place to the point where it takes away from the freshness of it a lot faster. So, with Pokemon X and Y, they're pretty much saying that the game is going to be unhackable, you won't be able to transfer any Pokemon into it because it'll delete your game, and with those rules in place, it's pretty much the end of competitive battling as we know it for now. I mean, there will still be competitive battling in a sense, but it's going to be a lot slower of a metagame, that's for sure. People aren't being able to raise their Pokemon to perfect stats as fast as we can now, currently in 5th gen. So, with all that in mind, what are your opinions? What do you think about this? I personally welcome it. It's like a... It's kind of like a destructive welcome, like I welcome the chaos. I can't wait to see what it's going to be like because it's going to be hilarious. Like, oh man, it's going to be so fun. But what do you think? I want to know, what do you think about the ability to not hack anything in Pokemon X and Y? Are you looking forward to going back to the basics and breeding Pokemon and, you know, ditto holding the Everstone and everything? Or will you be upset that this easy functionality of importing Pokemon through Pokesaw, Pokegen is being taken away? I really want to hear your opinions, so let me know. If you have any questions, let me know, and I can answer them in a future Q&A answer video. But until then, guys, I will talk to you all later. This has been another Blair of Pokemon X and Y news. Take care of yourselves, and of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.